let's take a bite. Hi everyone. We are having very late breakfast today. This is what I got. McDonald's. And um, I'm just going to be honest about it now. I have not gone very adventurous at all today. All I got was a bacon and egg McMuffin and hash brown. Because honestly, you, hang on, too noisy. You just can't go wrong with these things, right? They're old favorites, you know, they're tried and tested. I'm just not in the mood today to try something new. Although, going forward, next time I go to McDonald's, I will try something new for you. But we haven't done a breakfast one yet, so here we are. Bacon and egg McMuffin. Hash brown. Haven't done my nails. Sorry about that. And I did not get a drink because I don't want plastic. So I brought some tea, which I think still might be hot. So I'm not going to drink it yet. These cups, they're Contigo. I got it from Howard's Storage World about six years ago. It's still going strong. These are so good at keeping drinks hot. And they've got a little thingy here so you can drink through the lid. You just press the button. And also that lets the hot air escape every now and again too. But we're not here to plug a thermos cup. We're here to eat McDonald's. I've got no makeup on today because I was in a hurry this morning. And I'm out and about, and I've got stuff to do, so we're just going to go with it. Can I just take a moment to say, I know I shouldn't, but I love it when the cheese gets stuck on the wrapper, because there's nothing better than just eating that by itself. Okay. Yum. Delicious, right? Let's take a bite. Mmm. What I love about these is the eggs not runny. I like runny eggs on toast, not in a McMuffin. Because the cheese is gooey enough. Mmm. That's really good. And they had this BLT BLT McMuffin at McDonald's this morning. And a friend of mine loves them. And I was going to try it. But I just really wanted that gooey egg and cheese sort of combination. And I, so I almost asked for a BLT McMuffin with cheese on it. But then I realized as I was driving up to the order, what did they call that? Order box? Microphone-y thing? Order section? I don't know. Um, let me know in the comments if you know what that's called. I realized as I was driving up to that that there's no egg in it. So, yeah. So that's why I went with the standard bacon and egg McMuffin because, you know, I already know it's that good. And I feel like a BLT is more lunchy. Yeah, so I didn't wear makeup today because I was in a hurry. And I thought, you know what? I'm not doing anything that involves lots of people anyway. Um, except filming YouTube videos. <laughs> but it doesn't feel like I'm in front of a lot of you at a time there. Hmm. Hash browns. These are so good. I feel like these are more comfort foodie in the morning than pancakes even. Yum. You know what I haven't eaten in years? A sausage genetic McMuffin. I just, I, I can't. I can't get on board with the idea of sausage 
I mean, I you have a full English breakfast, there's sausage in that. So I get the appeal. Oh, still too hot. Uh, oh, very minty though. Mmm, I buy loose leaf peppermint tea now and it's just, oh, it's like, you know when you buy a bar of Cadbury's peppermint chocolate and you break it open and it's got that sort of gooey pepperminty stuff inside? This peppermint loose leaf tea smells exactly like that chocolate tastes. It's amazing. It doesn't smell chocolatey, but it's the mint inside. Anyway, what were we saying? Sausage and egg McMuffin. Okay, so I, I can get where they're coming from with sausages and breakfasts and that sort of thing. That's fine. For me, sausages is more of a dinner food or a lunch food if you have it on a roll, like when you go to Bunnings and you get a sausage on a roll with onion. Mm. Why do I always end up talking about food while I'm eating food? Who knows? But sausage and egg McMuffin, I think the reason I don't find that very appealing is it's round and flat, and that's not what a sausage is. A sausage is long. Welcome to Marissa's Mukbang, where Marissa rang, rants and raves about foods being the wrong shape. Anyway. So it doesn't seem like a real sausage is really what I'm saying. And do you get sauce on it? Because sausages really should come with sauce. And sausage and cheese together? Mm. Oh no, wait, there might not be cheese. Because it's a sausage and egg McMuffin. But then this is a bacon and egg McMuffin and it came with cheese. I don't know. You know what? I'm probably overthinking it. It's been a very big week. Busy week. Fun week, but busy week. Hmm. You know how I was talking to you in another video about my parenting struggles? Can I just say today, much better. Although, to be honest, I've only seen my kids for about, you know, an hour before I drop them off at school. So who knows what it's going to be like in the afternoon. Did you see that behind me? No, you probably didn't see it. A truck just kind of tailgated a car next to me and I thought they were going to swerve into me and hit me. Ooh, they're road raging down the road a bit. Now that car's moved over and the truck's gone around them. Now I can't see them anymore, so hopefully it ends well. So the kids have been much better today. Oh. We'll see if that continues on throughout the afternoon. We're just having a home day today. No running around, no visiting, visiting people, no after-school activities. Mine don't really do after-school activities. I just love being at home. I'm a bit too lazy to run them around. I mean, they do lots of stuff at school. There's gymnastics, there's choir, there's music. Um, you know, there's plenty to keep them busy. So why not just let them play in the afternoon? Still too hot. Why not just let them play in the afternoon when they get home? They can go to the park. You know, we can walk the dogs, they can ride their bikes, they can play with neighbourhood friends. There's already a ton of stuff to do at home. I don't need to run them around for hours. When they're older, they might want to. And then I can let them choose one thing. Sophie did drama last year. And that was really good, but... Actually, it really helped her a lot. She's so much more confident now. You know, with things like getting up on stage at school, or, you know, just in general, she's very confident compared to, say, two years ago. And the drama was fun. But it's quite expensive and, you know, running around. It's like they get home from school and then you've got to rush them to get ready for something and then you've got to drive them there and then you've got to wait around for an hour. 
and then you got to drive them home. I'm a terrible parent. I'm way too, I might be too narcissistic. I don't know if that's the word. I'm just not very good at doing everything for everybody else, you know. My kids are happy. They play in the afternoons. They're happy. I'm happy. Sophie didn't give up drama because I made her. She had enough after a year. So it's open. I'm open to it if she wants to do it in the future. Okay. Now I've got all my focus on you, little hash brown. Mmm. That's really good. I don't think I've ever had a bad hash brown. I've even, even made them at home before. And that's been good too. Okay, that's it. So, I'm going to take these wrappers home and recycle them. The only downside to that, sorry, it's probably noisy. <laughs> the only downside to saving the wrappers and recycling them, because if McDonald's has recycling outside, I haven't seen it. And there's no council or local bins that are just for recycling that I can see around here. So the only downside we're taking this home to recycle it is that my car's going to smell my, like McDonald's all day. So I think I'm going to put this in the boot. But yeah. So good job McDonald's on the no plastic. This is just still too hot. I'm going to try it. Oh no, I'm too scared. No, I'm going to try it. Hang on. No, it's too hot. You know what? We will have tea together another time. That should be fine in about an hour. <laughs> okay, everybody. I'm going to go. i got lots to do today and I really should get started on it. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up so that I know. Comment below and let me know if you want to see anything uh, in particular next. And if you haven't subscribed already, go ahead and do it now and tap the notification bell because I would love to see you again and spend some more time with you in a future video. All right, that's it. I'm going to go. Have a great day and I'll see you in the next video.